That's a bit weird watching someone sleep. All right, cool. Basically, damn, I look ugly as hell. I always look ugly in the morning for some reason. I need to get that sorted out. But anyways, man, I literally just woke up and the way I woke up was not good. The way I woke up was that I was having a nice sleep. I was having a nice dream, like a banging dream. And then all of a sudden, I wake up to my dog licking my face. Yeah, my dog was literally licking my face, which woke me up. It was like something you'd see in a movie where the dog licks someone's face and they wake up. But the thing is, that wasn't the worst part. The worst part is, my dog's breath is stinky as hell. I mean, that shit is stinky as hell. And I woke up to it all over my face. That shit is so stinky that I could smell it from a mile away. Imagine how stinky it would have been, like, right near my face. Jeez. Oh, flip. And the worst part is, my dog doesn't even look like he's sorry for me. Like, look at him. He's having a nice sleep. But yeah, man, uh, enough of me complaining. Let's get this video started. All right, I want to start something new. Everyone repeat, all right, cool, basically, after me. In three, two, one. All right, cool, basically. Do you brush your teeth before you eat breakfast or do you brush your teeth after you eat breakfast? Man, I swear down, Coco Pops is life. Mmm. Mmm. Coco Pops is definitely life. And by the way, my dog is still sleeping. Alright, man. Ah. Oh, the sun is literally blinding my eyes right now. Let me turn this way. All right, yeah, let's just cut to the chase. Uh, I always go to this Chinese buffet and they have this fondue at the back of the restaurant. And uh, in my mind, when I always walk past it, I always think to myself, how would it taste if I mix food with the fondue? I don't actually do it, because if I do, they'll probably kick me out and I don't want that. So yeah, so I've always wanted to try food with fondue. And that's exactly what I'm about to do now. I'm about to go get some McDonald's, because McDonald's is just McDonald's. And I'm going to mix the McDonald's with the fondue and see how it tastes. Gosh, you right? You right? Flip. Okay, in order for this video to work, I need a fondue machine, a chocolate fountain machine. So that's exactly what I bought. I bought this big chocolate fountain and hopefully it works properly because otherwise then I'm just screwed. Let me just open this up. So yeah, you got this thing here. I guess you put this in here. There we go, that was easy. I'm gonna put chocolate into this machine here. This should give me a nice chocolate fountain and uh, yeah I'm gonna get some McDonald's and mix it in and taste it and see how this taste test goes if you guys want me to put something else instead of the chocolate into the machine let me know and then I'll try it and see how it tastes but yeah it's a nice day today man it's a nice nice day all right before I go to McDonald's let me call them and ask them if the food tastes nice with chocolate they better say it does because otherwise I'm still gonna go out and buy some but you know all right it's going through hello you're right I've got a question for you uh, can I ask you a question Hello? Sorry, yes, no. Yeah, does your food taste nice of chocolate? Sorry? Does your food taste nice of chocolate? Alright, I've changed my top because I don't want chocolate on uh, my other top. I don't know how this thing works, but I've got my McDonald's here. I think this is how it's done. After you uh, pour it in, you got to lick the bowl. That chocolate's actually nice. Oh, sh**. Finally, we've got that to work. Now all we have to do is 
taste test these McDonald's. Let me go eat the double cheeseburger first and see how that tastes when it goes under the chocolate fondue, fondue machine. Fondue? Fondue? I don't even know how to say it, but yeah. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm not gonna eat everything. Like, I'm just gonna take a bite because I'm on a strict diet and if I eat everything that I've bought, I'll probably get a big booty, not on my backside, but on the front side. There'll be a big booty like this. I'll be a big booty ho, but the opposite way. What is this? Let me take another bite. It tastes like bread with Nutella. You can't taste the meat. Wait, let me take one more bite. All right, I'm sorry, man, I couldn't resist it. McDonald's burgers are kind of buff. Like, once you take one bite, you just have to keep eating. Now, I'm gonna switch it up and try the Coke with the fondue. That's nice. Not gonna lie, that was low key kind of nice. All right, the burger was nice. The drink, surprisingly, was nice. Now let me try the good old chicken nuggets. See, look. It's nicely sitting on there. Okay, that's disgusting. That's disgusting. The nugget is disgusting. Don't try the nugget. Oh, gosh, I need to wash my mouth. Okay, next, we're gonna try some fries and McDonald's fries is bar. When you get fries, you're not supposed to get get them one by one. You're, you're supposed to go in and get like five. Okay, look, it's on there. Gosh, it's dripping everywhere. Uh, that is vile. If there was a word more disgusting than vile, it's that. That's how disgusting that was. I'm getting put off fries now after that. Okay, we're slowly getting through this. Next. It's a wrap from McDonald's. Ugh. Ugh. Oh gosh. Okay. It's just going downhill. It's going downhill, man. It kind of tastes nice as well, for some reason. I'm gonna carry on eating. Okay, I think we've only got like two more stuff to go. One of them is the Big Mac. Ah, oh, this thing is just so nice but I don't know how it would taste under the fondue machine. Mmm! Okay, I don't know whether it's weird or not, but this tastes nice. Mmm! Mm -mm -mm. I said I wasn't gonna eat all of that, but Big Macs are too nice, man. We're on to our final thing, which is the Happy Meal. I'm just gonna put the whole box under the, under the chocolate and eat the box as well. No, I'm joking. I'm just gonna get the... Oh, toy! Wait, back in the day, I used to love getting toys in this thing, man. It was like, life is complete. That, that's how good it was, getting a toy in this. And also, this reminds me of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. If you know about Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, you know. Like, the amount of times I wanted to drink that chocolate from that chocolate fountain. Okay, why does this taste nice? What is going on? All right, man, I changed back uh, and I'm outside now, all cleaned up. Unless there's chocolate on my face. Yeah, but I can't see anything. But yeah, uh, that challenge was interesting. It was something different, uh, but I'm never mixing chocolate with food again, man, because that was nasty. But yeah, if you like the video, please subscribe, like, and share it. And um, yeah, thanks for the support once again. I'll see you in my next video.